very welcome. Today we are going to engrave an image on a wine glass. This is an ordinary wine glass. If you are not so good at engraving, a good start is to practice on a glass jar or something that you can recycle if you don't like the result. First thing is to print the picture. This is a picture of a narrow gauge steam locomotive. A good size for the picture is approximately 5 to 7 centimeters high and 5 to 7 centimeters wide. It's time to fasten the picture inside the glass. A good thing is to tape up the picture inside the glass and then fill the glass with cotton. Cotton will reduce the noise a bit and also hold the picture in place. My tool for engraving is a homemade tool because I bought the pen for engraving but the motor was too weak and it burned and uh, then I changed the motor to a stronger one from a fan that was connected to the USB connection on the computer. That means that my own homemade engraving tool can be run from a computer USB or this one or at this time from a power bank. When you're engraving in glass or metal or something else you have to protect you from the dust. That means that your nose and mouth should be protected and also your eyes. The top of the engraving tool is moving and that's the secret in engraving. Another secret is that the top of the engraving tool has a diamond tip and the diamond tip is going to, to cut the glass. You are just using it as a pen and don't press too hard and don't press too soft. You need some training to do the right pressure on the glass when engraving. Just throw the picture on the glass. It is not so hard that you might think it is. But it is hard to see the result before you remove the cotton and the picture. And then you can see some mistakes and that means that you can correct them. You also notice that the level of noise is higher without the cotton inside the glass. Be extra careful with the glass without the cotton inside when you're engraving on it. When you're finished, now it's time to wash it, just to be sure that there is no dust left. And after that, you can see the fine result here on the picture. Now, thank you for watching and good luck with your own engraving.